Okay, today we are actually gonna do a DIY on a generator. Um, it's a generator we have on site, and um, I actually broke the string today, so we're gonna replace the string. Um, we're gonna check the oil, we're gonna check the spark plug, um, and check the filter, make sure everything's clean, good, clean up the machine, and get it back to site for tomorrow. So that's today's DIY, generators. Replacing your pulled cord, take your panel off, make sure you don't lose your pieces, and and I'll make sure that all your pieces stay together. So I'm taking these little clips out, and then I will put these clips back. Um, back when we're done. But I just want to get this piece out. There's my string. I'm going to replace the string. Security for. Let's clean this up a little bit. We will fire this stuff as well. Once we're done, I just want to make sure everything's nice and clean. So this is our pull, this is our filter. We're gonna be changing the oil, we'll be changing the spark plug, and then giving this whole thing a clean. So let's get to work. So now this goes on here, like that. Clean that up as well. Slides into these. So these part, this part right here, we'll click into those and that's where we'll start it. filter, clean, and I'm not going to be using the uh, cleaner, window cleaner for everything, I have a rag here, but just for the stuff I have right now, and we'll clean it up with a, a wet rag, and that will just make it sparkle a little bit more.
the game. I'm just kind of tidying things up here. I think this machine was new when we got it. At least it looked pretty new. This is just water, a bit of soap. Remember, your generator works hard, so keep it maintained and it will keep working hard for you. This is your DIY by Ridgewater Homes.